Hey team, Luca Crusader Machining here. I had a couple people last week look at one of my shorts or videos and ask me about our bar feed. How it works, the way it works, and kind of explain a little bit more. We're going to cover that in this quick short here. Just a moment, we're going to do a first person view. Let's check it out. So here is our bar feed. This bar feed we have is servo driven. It's another type that's just pneumatic. When you get a collet open signal, the bar feed air power pushes until the bar hits the stop. That's pneumatic. This is servo driven. First thing that we do here, we make sure that our part length is correct. Our part length plus cutoff plus facing. When we get an open, collet open signal, collet opens, and then we give it, I believe it's an M61 to signal the bar feed to push up until a stop. They have it where you can push it just to a position, but I don't think that's as accurate as a positive stop. So you can see in our program here, T0414 is our stop. M11, call it open. M61, activate the bar feed, meaning it's going to push until it hits the stop. Four second dwell, then call it closed. It's going to look something like this. Bring up our stop. Now watch how it comes out. Boom, nice and gentle. Pneumatic style bar feed, it would slam up against the stop. We really don't like that. So that's how it works. It pushes up against a positive stop. It's uh, servo driven, like I said, so it goes nice and slow until it hits that stop. Any questions, leave a comment below. Thank you for watching.